Alafu hebu tuambie kuhusu hiyo ni massage. Ah, uh, hiyo ni massage is a vaginal massage. So people who ask for extras I I, I recommend them to do that because it gives you it gives you the same uh, satisfaction that sex would do or even better. You know most people believe that uh, sex must involve penetration but personally I don't believe that. So kukiwaka sana you can pay for yoni massage it's a, it's just a thousand so we massage your miss v down there unasikia fit ebu tuele so what what happens unafanya uh, <laughs> uh, it's basically massaging your your kamisis down there oh, pale. Uh, pale. Oh, yeah. yes 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 so yes. you massage that place i massage that place uh, into details long live the clan so recently we post at plania gifted hands massage and ideally um jamana massage was super okay and there right so this morning there is one industry that has really exploded and there's one guy who's making a big name out of it if you're on instagram i need you to go and search for massage by steve the average urban woman in kenya goes for two to three massages per week Bolja mimi mnipepee nafasi kwa DM. Ndio sema kama tizizi zikalala hii ni four play hapana. Zikalala msana wa nyandua zii mimi ningeza pata manzi yangu hapo tunaachana. And I'm like zii that's how it's done. That's it's a nudist massage, you know. Hi guys, there is Mojo here. Welcome to Stories at 254 and today I'm hanging out with Steve. Steve is the CEO of Massage by Steve Gifted Hands. Hi Steve. Hi to Doris, how are you? Hi. So Steve, tell us a bit about yourself. Uh, Steve is a 26 year old maso Kenyan uh, by birth and Steve is a kind human who who loves life I think that's all <laughs> So uh, let's just get dive into it ulianza lini like a massage uh, kwa industry ni lingia uh, around 2018 uh, kusoma kwa jiriwa but then freelancing ilianzia end of 2020 yeah hiyo period ya corona corona hiyo but then um, imekam ku pick around 2022 yeah so i kind of understand that uh, massage different massages in akwanga because of different reasons like in a therapeutic way so unaweza tuambia like the type of massage you do uh mainly uh, i do a massage we call sensual uh but I also do every other type of massage swedish aromatherapy deep tissue uh hot stones you know all those other types of massages but what I've uh, really focused on is essential massage please kwa sababu maybe kuna mtu kule ajui it's about what please elaborate uh the essential massage uh it's a type of uh, it's a type of a type of massage that um meant or uh, whose purpose is uh, to arouse ama to awaken your sexual side you know as a woman yeah so you only do massage for women yes uh, i used to do massages for men but i realized uh, there are quite a few challenges dealing with men so i decided to uh, you know focus on queens Okay okay so you come on is to ambia like the challenges perhaps you faced with doing massages for men um as you understand uh, in the society we are in right now most men are uh, gay so they used to think especially because they wear earrings that I'm gay too so they would uh, make advances you know get touchy uh, say we had stuff during my sessions with them uh, offer money for sex Yes yeah, so <laughs> I decided well uh, my mental uh, I cannot I cannot handle that so I decided to leave men alone and focus on ladies only So you've said that men used to offer money for you know extra whatever is so women have never uh the thing with women if you tell a woman no uh they understand or it's easier to reason with a man uh, with a woman compared to a man even if you tell a man no they will still insist 
especially kama kona nguvu kukushinda they'll try to aza kugeuzia kufinya mbaya sana but for a woman uh, it's easier to deal with them you know for a woman they, women have ego so you tell them no they're like ah sawa sitakubembeleza kijana you get but for a man akisha akisha kuamulia ah, it's difficult to deal with them yeah so i i i have seen your page on tiktok and um, most of the videos you you're, you're doing massage so uh, our clients ama the people you you're massaging the people you're filming wanaitikianga aje wafanyie massage ama mnafika ngaje uh these videos that i post are not of uh, clients they are my models you know to showcase what i do to the world yeah to advertise my work so for, uh, i don't i don't um uh, I don't post clans. There are clans who request to be recorded. So that I send them the videos, but then I don't record clans. I only record models. Yes. And um I think it's easy to you know to 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 convince someone to do uh the type of massage I do because one, I think I'm trustable. Uh two, uh they know it's a good thing. It was difficult when I was starting because uh Uh, people wouldn't understand what I'm doing but at least now it's becoming easy because uh, I think most Kenyans are civilized so they know these things and they want to try out the new things so it's not really hard to uh, make people understand what I do so girlfriend yako filaje akiona ati una massage wanawake like different types of women different colors unajua whatever and then you're touching them everywhere How does your girlfriend feel about that? Uh, uh which girlfriend? <laughs> My girlfriend. Uh to be honest, I'm not dating. I'm I'm so single. Uh mainly because of the nature of my job. Si semi si but I feel like um it would be too much for them. You know, uh coming back home every day or uh, them knowing that I do what I do every day. To traumatize a baby girl so uh, I'd rather be single until maybe uh later in life when I change careers or when I find someone who's really understanding. Yes. So, what thing you can wanataka kujua? Wewe unakula stock? Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's something I've seen in most of my comments yeah. and from most people they think na kulanga stock. Ah, kulanga stock. Is kulanga stock to be honest. I really respect what I do and I know if I start messing up with clans that's the end of me. But let's be honest. Uh-huh. I've seen your videos. They are quite mtu hata akiwacha na feel. So in that situation in that room what you need you are with mm-hmm. of course there is i don't know do you put on music ama yeah there's music there's music yeah. maybe the on a candle mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and then the vibe gets there mm-hmm. <laughs> how do you handle because uh okay that's the whole idea uh the massage that the sensual massage that i said i talked about is meant to feel to make you feel some type of way so there is actually sensual music or uh, soft rnbs uh cool lights you know dimmed lights uh candles and stuff like that uh it's made it's meant to make you feel some type of way uh let's say most of my clients they understand that they understand that uh, i'm going to steve not for anything else but to feel good to feel loved to feel appreciated you understand so even if their body reacts they know it's normal so na body yako wewe i react um i'm human i'm human that's what i like to say but as much as my body reacts uh i don't get i don't get tempted because i know um i tell myself that it's work You know, it's the client who's supposed to get the satisfaction out of the massage. It's not me. And how that's how I, I survive. Also by God's grace. And I'll pay you. So no extras. Ah, uh, no extras. What if somebody wants to pay you for extras? Uh, I have been offered money and as much as I'm kikuyu and I love money, uh I like to believe that I cannot see it or sheleza on Kenya or Nairobi or Kenya or all my clans. So, uh but I like to sheleza moja ni acha wengine, si ni acha wote. 
Yeah, just give it, give them good massages and vibes alafu maisha endele. Are you trying to say you are celibate? Uh no, I'm not celibate. Of course I'm oh. human. Uh, <laughs> and as much as I'm not in, in a relationship, I'm but do pair. But sina client, sina stock. Sina 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 stock. Uh I I differentiate the two. If you're coming to me as a client, it's a client. If you're coming to me as a you know mtu wa kunipea wewe ni mtu wa kunipea yeah so what inspires you every single day to like do your job oh, making people happy have you ever made someone happy it's the best feeling in the world like seeing someone else uh, feel happy because of you uh, i'll tell you something this massage the sensual massage the one you see me rocking people like babies you know uh kissing them on their hands kissing them on on, on the on the thighs on the on the uh it's not sexual it's uh it, okay it seems that way but the main reason i do that is to appreciate women just like they are you know women are not loved enough even by their men their men will be telling them oh you have you naka do you, you know change this change that when they come to steal I appreciate them just as they are. But on your page I most I'm honestly nimeangalia page yako most of the women there they look very nice or kuna nice bodies. Ah uh, okay ni 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 ni, ni camera ni lights na na, na effects. <laughs> Kwa ground mambo mambo ni different. But uh <clears throat> my models I used to I used to do with mainly small bodies models but right now i'm trying as much as i can to get plus size plus size models people with stretch marks people with you know all those uh, things that people will uh, body shame you about so uh, at least people can feel comfortable coming to me you come i appreciate you just as you are and i show you some love just as you are without judging at all so how long does a normal massage take uh normal massages is on is a spa is in ndanga 60 minutes Ah uh, unakimbizo hapo teke teke na therapist unampatia pesa yako then they don't care about you they care about the money me I'm in business yes but I also care about uh, client satisfaction so if, if you come to me a normal massage will take um, at least 90 minutes kuna zenye zinaendanga 2 hours 2 and a half hours 3 hours <laughs> so kwa hizo 3 hours by the quick question so of course the the the, the lady is um in the nude a coach mostly mostly now wewe uh mimi if you've seen my videos i'm either in sweat pants uh mostly in a vest or in a t-shirt uh sweat pants or a short so sikwangi uchi yeah zingekuwa na post mke uchi but people say the client is always light na right na client akitaka u uh hapa kwa still the client is always right but there is one rule and that i tell to my clients i'll do everything else but not sex anything else but not sex yes for real i'm too so you want to say every time when you meet those beautiful ladies you never feel how feeling mahanjam uh mahanjam Mm, nikisema feeling ni mahanja moto atasema si uko normal. <laughs> uh, but I think uh, during the period I've worked I've been in, in this massage industry mind yangu imeweza ku differentiate client na you know mboga as people like to say. So kama ni client na deal na yeye I know who ni client ni mrembo anakaa poa ni mali safi ni nini nini ananiangalia vi sexy but ni client so atwezi kuna line atwezi pita you know but nikipatana na msichana mahali maybe you've gone out i see a, a good looking woman says ikosa ku approach a man you get so hiyo tuna differentiate kazi you know na my social life yes client abaki kwa client mboga ibaki kwa mboga so um una offer services zenye mtu anaweza kuita kwake ama kitu kama hiyo yes yes uh, my 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 setup is in house as you can see but uh, i also do house calls you know like the people who, who want the service in their homes yeah so i go to them regardless of where they are you've never had like um maybe umeenda kwa mtu unamfanyia massage maybe somebody walks in ama you've never had like um 
a story like that? When I was starting, when I was starting, I I, I wasn't really I wasn't really careful. Uh, so some uh, I went to I went to, I went to some place uh Uko Feather. And uh, I don't know. Dem alikuwa ame break up na chali yake. Then chali yake akambiwa kuna mtu amekuja kwa dem yake ama kwa ex yake and the chali came. Uh, so they knock when I'm in my session. I excuse whoever is knocking. I'm I excuse my clan. So mimi nikaenda kwa balcony. But then nikiwa kwa balcony, uh, nikashangaa mbona watu wamekaa hivi. So I chungulia, I see them quarreling. And it was a huge man. So mimi nikaanza kutense. But nikaomba Mungu nikamwambia hata wewe unajua niko hustle, sijakuja hapa kufanya tabia mbaya. But this fanyagi tabia mbaya ni tabia mbaya nimeokoka na napenda hizo. So uh, I go in, I continue with the massage after nimaliza kwa roll, chalia katoka. Uh, within uh, within 5 minutes I knocked ten. And at this point I knew sasa kamewaka. Bro, mambo imechemka. <laughs> uh, but then I was I was wrapping up so nikamali nikamwambia client, let me just finish up. Na hata kakitamba at least nikwani nimemaliza kazi. Utasema sijamaliza kazi kwa sababu nilipa. So uh, he came in and he said he said he said by the way in a very in a very you know masculine voice. Endelea na kitu liko unafanya bro. <laughs> <laughs> so me told him uh, nimemaliza uh, I usually change most of the time so I was in a short and a vest so lazima sasa ni change into and it was a whole weird situation 